hi guys welcome back to my channel i hope you're all doing well um as you guys can see over here i'm just checking out my face and seeing how fat it looks on camera but anyways i'm bare faced all i have on is some eyeshadow primer and that's about it so we're gonna jump straight into foundation i have my face prepped and primed i'm using the um bare minnows bare pro foundation in the shade cashmere and i'm applying that all over my face using a damp beauty blender Next, I'm going to be using the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Glow Concealer in the shade 02 Creamy Natural. I'm applying this concealer on all the usual spots. I'm going to try to hide these bad boys as best as I can. And I'm blending this out using my damp beauty blender and yeah. And now to set the face and the under eyes, I'm using the Maybelline Fit Me Matte Poreless um, Powder in the shade 130 Buff Beige. Next, to bronze up the face, I'm using the Rimmel London Stay Matte Powder. It's actually a powder that I'm going to use as a bronzer. It's such a pretty shade. It's the shade uh, 025 Toffee. It's a very, very beautiful shade to um, use as a bronzer. So that's what I'm doing over here. I'm just going to use a brush like this one, and I'm just going to go ahead and kind of use it in a contour kind of a way, but not really too sharp, not too harsh, just bronzing it up and contouring it as well. So now I'm going to use a small brush like this to contour my nose. I'm just going to draw two lines, a little bit on the tip of the nose to give it that lift. And I'm going to blend it out softly later. Now I'm going to use a stippling brush like this and I'm going to blend out the bronzer and the nose contour to make it very soft and um, blended. For blush, I'm going to be using Rimmel London's Maxi Blush in the shade wild card for eyes i'm going to be using my makeup revolution emily's the want edit palette on a flat brush i'm going to be picking up this very pretty pinky shade is called laugh cry and i'm going to apply this in the crease I'm actually going to apply the same shade in the inner corners as well. I guess I decided I wanted to do a little halo eye. So we're applying it in the inner corner, the outer corner, and in the crease and blending it out generously. Just to darken up the outer V and the inner corner of the eyes, I'm going to be picking up this shade called Cheer. I'm going to apply it on the outer V and in the inner corners of my eyes to make it a, little, a bit more intense. I'm picking up this beautiful shade called Top Story and I'm going to apply it in the halo part of the eye where I didn't apply any other eyeshadow. That's where I'm going to apply it to give it that halo effect. And now I'm doing the same thing to the other eye before we move on. Here I'm just applying my winged eyeliner and yeah, we're going to go ahead and apply it on both of my eyes and I'll be right back. And now I'm going to go back into the shade Laugh, Cry and Cheer. I'm going to grab it on a small brush like this and I'm going to apply it under my lower lash line. Now I'm going to use my Revlon Photo Ready Eye Art in the shade 100 Topaz Twinkle. I'm going to use the glitter side. I'm going to create a little line right above where I created my halo just to give it that effect of like sparkle and glitter. And that's what I'm using here to create this. 
I applied my falsies off camera, you guys, and now I'm just jumping straight into mascara, and I'm using the L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara, which is my favorite. I'm using the Wet n Wild um, Lip Liner in the shade I Lay Down the Mauves to line my lips to make them appear a bit larger than they are. You guys, before I let you know what I'm using on my lips, just look at how cute the packaging is. I absolutely love it. It's so beautiful. And I'm using the Wet n Wild Mega Last Matte Lipstick in the shade Bear It All. And I absolutely just love it. Setting my makeup with the Wet n Wild Setting Spray 3-in-1 Cucumber. Using my Profusional Contour and Highlighting Kit. And I'm using one of the highlighting shades to highlight my face. Now sis, we can't go to a birthday party looking like this, so I'll be right back and I'm going to change into my outfit. And now here I am, you guys, looking all nice and pretty. Just kidding. I look okay. But anyways, thank you so much for watching, you guys. Give this video a big thumbs up. Comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!